How to Create an RGA Request With your Maya Online account, you have the power to start your own returned goods authorization request. Starting your own RGA request on your account saves you time by keeping you from calling and avoiding possible customer service wait times. You have options for completing this process. Creating an RGA request can be done by using your Meyer Online account on a desktop computer or using the Meyer Online app on your phone. The process is the same for both. The process is quick and easy. Simply log into your Meyer Online account. Make sure that you are under the correct location if you have more than one by checking the top menu on the left side of your screen. Once the correct location is selected, click Returns in that same menu on the left side. Once under the Returns tab on Meyer Online, find your documents by choosing Find Documents by PO, Find Documents by Order Number, or Find Documents by Item Number. Click the box that works best for the return you are making. If you use the Meyer Online app to make an RGA request, the steps are the same. However, you have the option to scan the barcode on the part you wish to return. In this example, we'll be using a PO number. Upon clicking the Find Documents by PO box, a window will appear. Enter the number in the window and click Search. Results will appear. Click Select at the end of the row for the order you need to return. Vendor RMA guidelines will appear. You need to read these guidelines before completing the RGA request. The return request form will appear. You must fill out the form as accurately as possible. Don't forget to attach images of the part you wish to return if it is defective or damaged. If you are using the app, you can directly upload images from your device to the form. Once you have completed filling out the return request form, click Submit RGA Request. Next, select the method of pickup that applies specifically to your return. In this example, we will use a Meyer truck. Make sure the physical address for the pickup is correct along with the required email address. This will be the address that we will contact you at if additional information is needed. Finally, click Submit Request to complete this process. You will see a success message on screen if the return is auto-approved. If the return requires further review, that will show in a banner as well. You can see what the status is on the pending return in your Open Documents tab by clicking the Pending hyperlink for that document. Once approved, your return will be picked up to complete the process.